I'm Santa Clara Mayor Lisa Gilmore. It gives me tremendous pleasure to congratulate all of you on this most blessed day, Eid al-Fitr, which marks the end of the holy month of Ramadan, a month for fasting, spiritual connection, empathy, and the giving of charity. Eid is one of the most significant Muslim holidays and is a time to not only celebrate with family and friends, although remotely this year, but also to share your blessings by reaching out to the less fortunate. During challenging times such as these, your acts of kindness and self-sacrifice serve as an example to Americans of all faiths. As Muslim Americans, you have long been a part of the history of the United States and have contributed greatly to the cultural fabric of our society. The city of Santa Clara is so proud to be home to the Muslim Community Association, and we value our strong ties to the Muslim community who have contributed to the social, cultural, and economic vibrancy of our region. With your dedication to charitable giving, our city and its residents greatly benefit from your neighborly care. On behalf of the Santa Clara City Council, it's my honor to wish all of you Eid Mubarak. Eid Mubarak. Peace and blessings to all of you. I'm Oakland's Mayor Libby Schaff, recognizing the end of the Holy Week of Ramadan and the end of a month-long fast for the 250,000 incredible members of our Muslim community here in the Bay Area. I want to express my deep gratitude. I know so many Muslims who have been making food available, who are our police officers, our firefighters, our frontline healthcare workers. You have been keeping our society safe and running during this holy month of tremendous sacrifice. I know in Oakland, we have such incredible members and leaders in our Muslim community. The service that I have seen your mosques and organizations engage in, the sacrifice, the love that you show for our whole community. Thank you so much and may this holy month be blessed and may all your sacrifice and service be rewarded. Hi, I'm Senator Scott Weiner. Uh, to my Muslim uh, friends and neighbors, I want to wish you uh, an Eid Mubarak. Uh, this has been an incredibly uh, challenging time, and I'm sure it has been difficult uh, for so many to observe the holiest time of the year uh, while sheltering in place without being physically together as a community. Uh, thank you for uh, staying home and for doing uh, your iftar dinners with only your households uh, and for praying at home. Uh, as we weather this pandemic, this crisis together, I'm particularly inspired by the pillar of zakat. Uh, the Muslim community in the Bay Area leads the way in showing what it means uh, to be charitable and to care uh, for our neighbors. Uh, this is a time of enormous sacrifice. Uh, Ramadan teaches us how important sacrifice is for the good of ourselves and for our collective uh, communities. I hope you're hanging in there and staying strong. Uh, I'm thinking of you during these difficult times. Together, we will get through this and we will be stronger uh, as a community. Uh, once again, I wish you and your families an Eid Mubarak. I'm David Chu, representing San Francisco in the California State Assembly. I'm also chair of the California Asian Pacific Islander Legislative Caucus. And on behalf of the caucus, I want to extend our greetings, our best wishes on the completion of Ramadan, and our sincerest Eid Mubarak to all of our Muslim communities in the Bay Area. The values exemplified by Ramadan of selflessness and of service to each other reminds all of us of the diverse faith traditions that make up the amazing fabric of our ethnic communities and the state of California. During these particularly challenging times, Ramadan gives our Muslim American communities an opportunity to express gratitude and to show compassion to those in need. Many Muslims have also been engaging on the front lines while fasting during this month, and to them we extend our heartfelt thanks for your commitment to your faith to your professions, and to all of our communities. May you have joy, happiness, and peace on this occasion. All my best to you and your families. Eid Mubarak. Greetings, I'm Michael Pappas, Executive Director of the San Francisco Interfaith Council. 
and to our more than 250,000 Bay Area Muslim sisters and brothers observing Eid al-Fitr, the festival of breaking the fast, I bring to you the prayers and best wishes of San Francisco's 800 communities of faith and greet you with the words Eid Mubarak. Like people of all faiths, the precautions taken to contain and limit the spread of the coronavirus have necessitated that we worship in isolation of one another, an unprecedented phenomenon never before experienced by worship communities in our lifetime. For Muslims, who, in, who have endeavored in Ramadan's month-long spiritual practice of fasting, self-sacrifice, prayer, charity, and service to others, this year's Ramadan and Eid are certain to live in our memory. As we gradually emerge from this season of forced isolation, it is my prayer that this year's Ramadan and Eid will take on new meaning as we citizens of the global community are called upon to re-envision our relationships with the planet, ourselves, one another, and our creator. I would be remiss if I did not commend the imams and other spiritual leaders of our local Muslim community, who for over two months have labored diligently to foster community in the midst of isolation through technology. These online occasions for religious observance, education, and fellowship have emerged as critical in maintaining continuity of religious life when other sectors of our society have been forced to close their doors. In closing, I wish to also thank the 1.8 billion Muslims across the globe for their countless contributions to the greater society and for blessing our interfaith efforts with the richness of your beautiful and centuries-old faith. God bless you.